Hi now family, it's Little Honey Bums Doll Nursery. Welcome to my channel. Just sharing a little update with you guys on my progress on this kit that I'm working on. I have done uh, a primer layer. First of all, first thing I did was I wiped it down real good with alcohol. And then I washed it real good in a warm uh, sink with dish soap, Dawn dish liquid. Scrubbed it real good and rinsed it real good and hung it up and let it dry for 24 hours. And then I did a primary, a primer layer, a, a base layer, and now I'm getting ready. And then I did some creases. So what I'm getting ready to do now is one skin tone layer. And then, oh, did I drop something? And then... I will be doing another, well I did a wash, I did one wash after it dried from the base coat, I did a wash. Now I'm just mixing, I don't have any fancy place to work, I'm sitting in my bedroom by the window in my granny chair. You know what I'm missing? I have a scoop cup that I usually pour my water into my bowl with so that I can measure it. My little, and I also have a squishy somewhere. One of those little tubes you suck the water up in or whatever you're working with up in. And I'm mixing skin tone color. I'm not gonna tell you what the color I'm going after, but this is how I do it. This is how I'm able to work in my environment. <laughs> oh, you know what? I meant to turn off the notifications so it won't keep popping up in here. Give me a minute. I'm going to turn that off. There we go. <laughs> no more interruptions. I'm only going to be here for a few minutes because I just wanted to share you guys with you guys my progress and what I'm working on. I don't have the best working conditions, but I do my best with what I have. Mix colors. I know you can hear outside noise. Of course it's 4th of July and there are people on my block who are cooking out and they're outside and making noise and they have music playing. So, what did you guys do for 4th of July? What did you cook? Who was gonna send me some potato salad? That's the one thing I want that I wasn't able to get today was some potato salad. Had I been able to get to the market, I would've got me some potato salad already made. Because I really can't do the job of making it much anymore. It's kind of hard for me to uh, sit around and stand for too long. Like, like what I'm working on here. I want to sit here for a little while until it, uh, until I can't, and then I will get up, put the things away, or cover the things, and I'll relax for a while. Hope you guys can't see me because I'm not dressed. <laughs> I have on cool stuff to stay cool. That's the color I want for now. And I will just put a little bit of color on there and I will dab it in. One little area at a time. I'm not going to bother to try to show you it because Making too much noise. 
So who's gonna send me some potato salad? <laughs> I decided I'm gonna make this baby because it's a very newborn kid. And I want to, uh, I'm gonna give him some newborn redness and a little bit of uh not uh, i like the milk lips but not some of them that i see with the milk palette right here i've seen them with this it's just too per, uh, uh, pronounced it's too white too big and it, it doesn't look right but i like the look of the baby with the milk lips so i'm going to try that but i'm not going to do it you know i'm not going to overdo it i should put it that way So there you have it. I'm not paying attention. I have to focus on what I'm doing. <laughs> I like to go in a rhythm. Like I'll start in a section like in the back of the neck and the back, back of the ears. And then I will move up in the back and on the sides. I like the way that's looking when I put the paint on. What I don't like is when it looks all bubbly and, and stuff. Like it looks like a pellet, you know what I'm saying? And you know it's not taking. But when it co goes on smooth like I'm seeing it do, that means it's taking. It's going to take me quite a few layers, of course. Everybody knows that before I start seeing any major results. But I have time. I'm going to take my time. Because I want to do a good job on this kit because this kit will be for sale when I'm done and no I'm not heat setting I, I don't prefer heat setting so if you are okay with acrylic paints what you all everybody calls air dryer is just acrylic paint just like heat set it's just oil paint I don't think anybody uses watercolor paint because first of all watercolor it's the only paint that's reusable once it dries. If it dries, all you have to do is wet it and, it and it comes back to liquid paint. Unless it's done on a canvas. You know, but most artists know that, so. I'm doing an ear now. And the side of the head. And then I will take my dagger brush and clear out any pooling behind the ears. I don't like that. And I learned that when I was first doing dolls, I would uh, see the dry pooling behind the ears and things like that. This is how we learn by boo-boos. <laughs> there, nothing behind the ears. No pulling in the ear. And I try my best not to go over the same areas twice, but sometimes it just happens. It's no big deal really, but. Eight minutes in. I wanted to get this head done with you guys and then I'll turn the camera off and get back to work on the limbs. But I always do my head first. I always do my head first because it seems to give me a, 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 a path to follow. You know what I'm saying? The only thing that I'm hoping for, I want them to my neighbors out there to have fun, but I hope they're not drinking liquor and stuff and, you know, how some people get out there and drink too much liquor, get loud and obnoxious, and then they want to discuss stuff, and then it turns into an argument, and then it turns into a fight. You know, it's the 4th of July. I always tell people when, when so celebration times, make it a memory, not a blur. Don't get drunk and stupid or whatever, you know. I mean, don't get me wrong, I have drinks sometimes, like when I was at my niece's house a couple of weekends ago. I had some drinks, but I'm 62 years old. I don't drink to get drunk. 
I just like the taste of certain types of uh, adult drinks, I should say. And of course, I might get a little bit of buzz, but I just get on the karaoke and start singing with my niece, with my niece and them, and the little and the kids and stuff. We just get to singing, you know. But some people get vulgar and just, you know, just just ruin everything. But anywho, I hope you guys are having a wonderful holiday. Making sure there's no pulling behind the ears or in the ears. I have some of those pointed Q-tips or in the creases, but uh, I'm good for now. Uh, you can't really see anything here. For in the camera, it just looks dull, but for me, I see a little bit of tint. See that color going there? You can't see it. It doesn't show up in the camera. But it's there. And I like the way it's going on. I'm sitting by the window and I have a, a, a friendly squirrel who comes and joins me sometime. Um, well, every day, I should say, for the years that I've been here. And I have named him Scurry. And he comes, when I come to the, sit by the window, he often comes by the window also. And he's looking for snacks. And I usually have crackers or potato chips or something like that that he likes and one time he was a, I saw him next door on the per people's porch next door and mind you there's an empty lot in the backyard full of trees and stuff and I said scurry and he looked up over he came running he ran along the house over there jumped over the fence up the trees and over the branches and over to our roof and jumped down on the, on the, the outside the window here I said darn it don't squirrel come when I call him <laughs> that was so funny I figure, oh, Miss Honey got some snacks. Let me go find her. See what she got to eat today. I'm in the facial area now. And I believe that I need to, uh, smooth out. You can't see anything, but I see it. I'm sweating. <laughs> I wish you could see this because I'm starting to see the difference already. And that's the thing I like about regular, I won't say regular acrylic, but the, the, the uh, acrylics that I'm familiar with because certain ones I know and I'm used to seeing how they work. And I did a, you know, I used Ultimate Fusion acrylic paints. And man, I was nowhere near, this is just the first skin tone layer and I already see the difference. Whereas when I used the Ultimate Fusion, I mean, I had to do like six layers before I even saw a, a, just a bit of a tint and it got to be annoying to me. Excuse me. But I went on and f I kept on adding. I went on and I finished. You know, because I knew I started with the Ultimate Fusion and I didn't want to switch paints. But, uh, I haven't used it since. And don't get me wrong, I'm not putting it down. It just doesn't work for me. If you like Ultimate Fusion, that's fine, but it doesn't work for me. You know. I need something to put this on because my finger is getting numb. <laughs> I dab off the excess. And I'm sure not to get it in the lip area because that's going to be a different color. Okay, guys, I'm dripping with sweat now, so <laughs> I'm going to let you go, and I'll keep you updated on my progress, but I'm going to go in the bathroom and get a cold washcloth and, and uh, freshen up my face 
and get some ice in my glass and make myself a cold drink and take a break. My back is a little getting a little funny. Gotta go put some cold water on my washcloth. It's hot out here today. And like I said, our air conditioning, our central air is broken and it's getting fixed, but it ain't fixed yet. So anyway, guys, have a happy 4th of July and I'll talk to you again soon, okay? Uh, thank you for stopping by. If you're new to my channel, this is a doll channel and I'm working, sharing some uh, progress on a kit that I'm working on. And um, my regulars, thanks for coming back again and I'll see you again soon. Always be kind. Bye-bye, guys.